the 31st of August 2022. Top 5 Morning Headlines Nagesh Singh appointed as India's ambassador to Thailand. Reliance Industries to build world or as largest carbon fiber plants. Noted agri economist Abhijit Sain passes away. Indian Railway set up, make dooth machines at Mumbai stations. Were technology to make debut in FIFA U-17 Women's World Cup in India. Nagesh Singh appointed as India's ambassador to Thailand. Nagesh Singh, an Indian Foreign Service officer of the 1995 batch, has been appointed as India's next ambassador to Thailand. Singh will replace the incumbent ambassador Suchitra Durai. Nagesh Singh is presently working as a Joint Secretary in the Ministry of External Affairs. In August 2022, Vikram K. Dore Swami was also appointed as India's new High Commissioner to the United Kingdom. Reliance Industries to build world's largest carbon fiber plants. Reliance Industries will set up India's first and one of the world's largest carbon fiber plants in Hasira, Gujarat. The plant will have a capacity of 20,000 million metric tons per annum. The first phase of the plant will be completed in 2025. Carbon fiber is a lightweight material with high conductivity that has the potential to replace steel. Reliance in Chairman Mukesh Ambani Noted agri-economist Abhijit Sain passes away. Abhijit Sain, India's noted agriculture economist and former member of the erstwhile planning commission, passed away on the 29th of August 2022. He was a strong advocate of the public distribution system of food grains and a distinguished rural economy expert. Between 2004 and 2014, Sain served as a member of the planning commission. He was also awarded the Padma Bhushan for public service in 2010. Indian Railways set up, make dooth machines at Mumbai stations. Indian Railways have set up, make dooth machines at Dadar, Thane and other stations of the Mumbai division. These unique, make dooth machines use innovative technology to convert water vapor in the air into portable water. The contract for setting up these Make Dooth machines for a period of five years has been awarded to Matri Aquatech PVT Ltd. Were technology to make debut in FIFA U-17 Women's World Cup in India. Video assistant referee Were technology will be used for the first time at a FIFA U-17 Women's World Cup to be held in India in October 2022. The word technology supports the decision-making process of the referee in game-changing situations. It will be the third FIFA Women's Tournament to utilize war following the U-20 Women's World Cup Costa Rica 2022 or the Women's World Cup France 2019. Tata Steel links Mao with Punjab Golf to set up steel plant in Ludhiana. Tata Steel has signed and Mao Nagesh Singh appointed as India's ambassador. Reliance Industries to build world's largest carbon fiber plants. Reliance Industries will set up India's first and one of the world's largest carbon fiber plants in Hasira, Gujarat. The plant will have a capacity of 20,000 million metric tons per annum. The first phase of the plant will be completed in 2025. Carbon fiber is a lightweight material with high conductivity that has the potential to replace steel. Reliance in Chairman Mukesh Ambani Noted agri-economist Abhijit Sain passes away. Abhijit Sain, India's noted agriculture economist and former member of the erstwhile planning commission, passed away on 29 August 2022. He was a strong advocate of the public distribution system of food grains and a distinguished rural economy expert. Between 2004 and 2014, Sain served as a member of the planning commission. He was also awarded the Padma Bhushan for public service in 2010. Indian Railways set up, make dooth machines at Mumbai stations. Indian Railways have set up, make dooth machines at Dadar, Thane and other stations of the Mumbai division. 
These unique, make do machines use innovative technology to convert water vapor in the air into portable water. The contract for setting up these make do machines for a period of five years has been awarded to Matri Aquatech PVT Ltd. Her technology to make debut in FIFA U17 Women's World Cup in India. Video assistant referee her technology will be used for the first time at a FIFA U17 Women's World Cup to be held in India in October 2022. The word technology supports the decision-making process of the referee in game-changing situations. It will be the third FIFA Women's Tournament to Indian Railways set up make do machines at Mumbai stations. Indian Railways have set up make do machines at Dadar, Thane and other stations of the Mumbai division. These unique make do machines use innovative technology to convert water vapor in the air into portable water. The contract for setting up these make do machines for a period of five years has been awarded to Matri Aquatech PVT Ltd. Her technology to make debut in FIFA U17 Women's World Cup in India. Video assistant referee Her technology will be used for the first time at a FIFA U17 Women's World Cup to be held in India in October 2022. The word technology supports the decision-making process of the referee in game-changing situations. It will be the third FIFA Women's Tournament to utilize war following the U20 Women's World Cup Costa Rica 2022 or the Women's World Cup France 2019. Tata Steel links Mao with Punjab Golf to set up steel plant in Ludhiana. Tata Steel has signed and Mao with the Punjab Goft for setting up a steel plant with a scrap-based electric arc furnace EAF in Ludhiana. The EAF-based steel plant would produce construction-grade steel rebar under the company's flagship retail brand, Tata Tiscan. In free 2021-22, Tata Steel became the first steel rebar manufacturing company to receive Green Pro certification. NHPC Inc's Mao with PTC India Limited. NHPC Ltd on the 30th of August 2022 signed in Mao with PTC India Ltd for the sale of power to be generated from the upcoming West Seti and Seti River 6 hydropower projects in Nepal. As per the Mao, PTC shall purchase the contracted capacity of these projects from NHPC for onward sale in India and the neighboring countries. NHPC Limited founded 1975. Chairman Abhi Kumar Singh. ICAT Partners North Cap University for Research on Air or Emerging Tech. The International Center for Automotive Technology ICAT, has signed and Mao with Gurugram based North Cap University to conduct joint research in the field of electric vehicles or related emerging technology. Under this pact, Several courses will also be conducted for skill development in this field. ICAT, established in 2006, is a division of the Ministry of Heavy Industries, Goft of India. Know about Thailand. Thailand, officially known as the Kingdom of Thailand, is a country in Southeast Asia. It or is known for tropical beaches or ornate temples displaying figures of Buddha. Thailand which means or Elkwo, land of the free, or Adikyo, was known as Siam until 1939. Agriculture and tourism are the most important industries in Thailand. Capital, Bangkok. Official language, Thai. Monarch, Vajira Longkong.